This segment is sponsored by Dona Ana Community College. Welcome back to Daytime. I'm Amy Lee Sedio. Today I'm speaking with the president of Dona Ana Community College. And I'm being told what is being done to make sure staff and students stay safe as we head into the fall semester. Check it out. Doniana Community College is a medium-sized community college in southern New Mexico. We have uh, six locations, three in Las Cruces and three in the southern part of Doniana County. We serve somewhere in the neighborhood of six to 8,000 students, taking both credit classes for certificates and degrees. And then we also have a large non-credit program as well. For the last few months, we've really been wrestling with COVID-19, and there are two principles that we've tried to operate by. One is, how do we help students continue to make academic progress and to reach their educational goals? But the second principle is, how do we do that safely? So all of our planning and all of our op operations these days is really geared trying to meet both of those goals. So, for example, um, in the spring, we moved our operations to online delivery modes. We did everything we could to make sure students got to class met their advisors, got tutoring, but we had to do that online. So that's the major step that we took. We will do that for the fall as well. Uh, but one of the things, Amy, that we discovered is that you can't teach everything online. So for example, if you think career technical education programs like welding and HVAC and auto, there are things that students have to do to develop skills and to demonstrate those skills that we actually have to do face to face. So we are going to have a few hybrid sections in the fall semester. Um, and when we do that, we will use CDC, Department of Health guidelines, um, as well as sanitizing and cleaning practices. We'll use all of those um, just to make sure that, that the limited face to face operations we have in the fall for those necessary students are safe and, and our faculty and employees are safe as well. We have a special program right now in the southern part of the county for people who live there. And that is a program we call Avanza. And what this program does is it helps students connect with college and community resources that then helps them earn college credentials and a higher paying job. Right now, that program is specifically focused on students who have children under the age of eight or are currently employed in low wage jobs. What we're able to offer is quality instructional opportunities for our students, but I don't want to cut short the idea that it's affordable. I think that if someone were to go to DACC's webpage and look at our tuition rates, you would find that we were more than competitive with lots of institutions in, in um, this part of the country and across the country. So for more information on Doña Ana Community College, you can find them online, dacc.nmsu.edu.